Welcome back to the 7 o'clock show. Now, Lorraine Butler's grandmother, Olive Chester, was told she was going on a trip to London for her 80th birthday. It's a nice present. Nice gig. Very nice, but it got even nicer because her granddaughter had a surprise in store. So you'll be clearing U.S. customs? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. For your flight to New York? Uh -huh. For your flight to New York? You're going to... Olive and Lorraine join us now on the couch. Oh, Welcome to the guys. Such a great story. A brilliant, brilliant story. When she said US customs, did the penny not drop <laughs> down? I, you Olive. Know, you know, I, I was standing at the desk, yeah. and uh, the, the, you know, the girl behind the desk, I was like, Lorraine was doing all the business, so I was, all I had to do was nod my head or say whatever. I, I didn't even hear what the girl was saying. <laughs> yeah. I was just... Mm -hmm. oh, mm -hmm. So we're taking the long way to London. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I, 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 I mean, I, I didn't have to do anything because I was, I had my sterling. Yeah. And I was, I mean, I was going oh, over. Oh, did to you get a good race? <laughs> when you it back? Yeah. <laughs> You'd have got a few more dollars, wouldn't you? I would have, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I went, I went to America with no dollars. I mean, I didn't even know I was going there. I mean, that's the thing, like. It. Well, well, from what we've been told. I don't really think you needed money when you got there, but we get to that in a few minutes' yes. time. No, I didn't. Totally <laughs> spoiled. Oh, absolutely. I uh, was. L Lorraine, this was engineered like a military manoeuvre because you couldn't do involve social media because this woman is really up She's to speed on social media. <laughs> yeah. so, so how much organising went in and how many people were involved? There was a few people involved. It wasn't so bad like because it was her eighth year, we were going to go to London anyway, so yeah. it was easy to get her to the airport. But there was a few little tricks that I had to make sure that I had coverage. Like she had a pacemaker fitted during the week or during the year, so I had to make sure that that was, she was okay to fly for so long. Yes. I kept telling her about the heat wave in London. Like there's a heat wave in London. You don't need to carry <laughs> any anoraks. You can leave them all at home. Like it's really, really hot over there. Scorchio. Packed lightly. Yeah. Um, yeah. And I got a few like the neighbours in and whatever, and it all went off very, very smoothly. Obviously, she was completely shocked. By I it, know. So. All of you were genuinely shocked, weren't I you? Was. I you really looked lost was. for words. I really was. I got an, I got, I, re, I, I was shocked, completely and utterly shocked. Such a surprise. I couldn't believe it. I was this, this was your first time in New York. Was Never it? been there before, but I always wanted to go. Did you love it? Oh, God, I did. I really did. <laughs> Such I a special that. place. <laughs> it is, no, don't worry, we always it, say God. <laughs> and look at the, you guys there. Oh, and as Marty said, <laughs> you, you were treated like royalty. I was, oh, yes. I mean, we got to the hotel, and uh, Lorraine said to um, the receptionist behind the desk, it's my nan's 80th birthday today, yeah. and um, the lady said, oh, congratulations, madam, ha happy birthday. And she went away, and then she came back, and then she said, you've been upgraded to the penthouse. Holy oh, moly! Yeah. That's, That's right. pretty good. Wowzers! <laughs> yes! And, uh, well, it sure, was luxury. that was something else like. And then um, um, we got, oh yeah, we got complimentary breakfasts. Wow! And, um, Free drinks in the bar. All of you are coming. <laughs> you are coming everywhere with me. Yeah. Yeah. Cocktails in the bar. Yeah. Well, wow. Well, I've also heard that the spoiling began on the plane, Lorraine. Because oh, it did, yeah. And so we got on, whatever, and she was brought down. We'd wheelchair assistance, just it's quite a long distance from check-in down to yeah. the plane or whatnot. Um, and we got on, and the girls on the on the cabin crew, they were fantastic. Came over and she had champagne and wine and... So it's like the wheelchair was needed to get off the plane. <laughs> Entirely, <laughs> yes. yes. <laughs> For both of you. Yeah. I, uh, say, no, say no more, say no more. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it was great. They were absolutely fabulous. And we waited at the end of the flight for all the other passengers to disembark, whatever, before they brought the wheelchair down. And the captain came out and she had her photo taken with him and whatever. Oh, right. So it was fantastic. lovely. Yeah. Lovely. It was brilliant. It's a nice welcome. It's so nice. You guys have always had a special bond, haven't you? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we're very close. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Always. It kind of started in the hospital. 
if I'm not mistaken, oh. when you went, first went to see her yes. as a baby. Yes, uh, I went in, 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 in uh, to see Lorraine, my, my daughter, and, you know, yeah. she's a new baby, because couldn't wait, like, with Nanny and Granddad Butler. Yeah. And uh, so when we got into the hospital, um, my daughter, Tracy, ran it in, brought out the baby in the cot, like, and everyone was, you know, the way you would get Yes, oh, lovely. Yeah. Oh, it's lovely. And she likes all that. And I, I'm standing there, and I'm saying, what's wrong with you all if you can't feel I, mean, I wasn't feeling anything for this baby. Like. Yes. All of a sudden, like, Tracy said, oh, wrong baby. <laughs> no. <laughs> wrong baby. No. She did. And so she ran back in, into, the, into, the, into the nursery and brought out uh, this, this one. This one. This one. This one. Oh. And, and as soon as, oh, as, soon as Lorraine came out, I'm standing there, and all of a sudden I felt this, it's what a grandmother feels, I suppose. Yeah, it's but a I know what bond. I felt. I felt this pull, the bond. Yeah. Instantly, instantly. Oh. Um, and it was absolutely lovely. And then, I, you know, they went out for a chat and I was holding the baby. And, of course, I loved that. Yeah. And then a few weeks later, I went up to babysit. And Lorraine is going to hate this now. <laughs> <laughs> I went up to babysit Lorraine. And, of course, like, as soon as the... Mammy and the daddy went out. The baby started to cry. Yes. Right. So I picks up the baby. And I'm cutting around the back. You'll be all right, darling. You'll be all right. And then I held her out like that. And there was two big tears flowing down her cheeks. Mm. And her little nose was running. And that I fell in love. Very and, I, <laughs> and I fell in love with my granddaughter. Aww. And I've been in love with her ever since. Okay. And I can truthfully say that. And I, th I, I think payback has been made. Yes. <laughs> yes. Definitely you so. have to come it's back. It's a great and, story. Come back now and, and join us again, won't you? I'd love to. On our next trip. More exciting adventures. Okay. See you in a bit, everybody. We'll be back after this very short break. <laughs>